Another big home weekend for Jacksonville State Volleyball. They get ready to host the conference leaders, Murray State, Friday night. And then Saturday night, following the homecoming football game, Austin Peace here. Both matches will start at 7 o'clock at Pete Matthews Coliseum. Allison Zulke, one of the standouts for Jacksonville State this season. It's been the last couple of weeks have been very tough. You just got, just got to keep fighting and work your way through it, right? Yeah, we're just going to keep working together and seeing what we can accomplish this season. Uh, we definitely had a turnaround, I know, as a team. And I think great things from here on out. A lot of injuries, so I guess you got to turn around a lot of times and figure out who's out there playing beside you, though. <laughs> yeah, it definitely changed the lineup a lot this year, but uh, adversity, and we just worked through it, and makes us stronger as a team. You had a, a very good season last year, got some awards, uh, accolades at the end of the year in the Ohio Valley Conference. What about your performance this year? How, how would you grade yourself? Um, I'd say a little bit stronger this year. Uh, I mean, I got the player of the week that one week, so I mean, I had one good week. <laughs> But um, I think about the same as last year. And you're playing some uh, back line now, too. So uh, yeah, that's yeah. a little bit different, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I like getting in there and getting some digs while I can. It's nice. You are a long way from home, but your folks have gotten to see you play, I guess, a little bit more this year than they did last year, right? Yes, they came to um, our home tournament, and they've come to two games this year now. And they watch the whole family watches every game online. So. Oh, pressure's on. <laughs> Is it tough being so far away from home and not, not seeing them a whole lot? Um, it definitely is, especially last year. Adjusting the first semester was really hard for me because I'm a big family girl. Um, and 12 hours is a long way away. But um, it helps. I, I talk to mom and dad every day. Um, my brother, I Skype him. I talk to my aunt and my uncle. Um, they live in Ohio. I actually came to my games last weekend in Kentucky. Um, but, yeah, it's hard. I miss my puppies. Her puppies, wow. <laughs> we'll just have to get you one to keep here in your apartment. I am getting a cat next week, so. <laughs> I'll go. No, never mind. We won't go there. Uh, all right, Murray State Conference leader. They'll be here Friday night. Had a very good year so far. I think they just got beat last weekend for the first time in league play. Does it get you a little more excited? Uh, are you a little more anxious about Friday night than you normally would be? Uh, no, I'm pretty excited. I love every game, uh, especially home games are my favorite. Um, of course, and you have all your fans here. But no, I'm really excited. I love tough games. I think those are the funnest. So I'm excited. And playing here in the new, I'll call it Pete Matthews Coliseum, it's a little bit different. I get some folks in here, a lot of noise. Isn't it? Yeah, it's a little bit louder and I love it. Uh, it's obviously beautiful. Um, yeah, the floor is nice, the air conditioning, like it's just a wonderful place to play now. Thank you, ma'am. Good luck this weekend. Thank you. Mackenzie Rombach in her first season, freshman year here at Jacksonville State. All right, you're an Illinois girl. You're a Chicago, not far outside of Chicago. How tough a decision, how tough was it for you just to leave home to come to Jacksonville State and play? Actually, it wasn't as tough as a decision as you would think. Like, when I came here, the team, the coaching staff and everything, the atmosphere here, I knew right away off the bat. And I know my parents and family are there back home giving me support, so. So they're keeping up with everything that goes on, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> All right. Uh, what, hour and a half south of Chicago? Is it like Jacksonville to some degree, small town, or is it a whole lot bigger than Jacksonville? It's pretty comparable to Jacksonville. It's pretty small, not too big, not too small. So it's the right size, right in the middle, just like Jacksonville. Who else recruited you when you were coming out of high school? Um, I was looking at a few other mid-major Division One schools, as well as some Division Two schools, but compared to Jacksonville, this was the place to so be. So this was home once you this, visited, right? Definitely. I walked on and I knew right away. Has it been an adjustment, the speed of the game in high school compared to, to Division One volleyball in college? Definitely compared to high school. I mean, there's always that speed up of the game, but I'm pretty sure my club, they can eh. <laughs> They um, prepared me, and I mean, yes, there was a momentarily trying to get into the groove, but I think it went well. From what I know of the, the volleyball in the Chicago area, and especially the club volleyball, is very good, isn't it? Yes, definitely. Where I came from, sports performance, they prepared me mentally as well as physically for this, and yeah, now I'm here now. <laughs> well, we talked to Zulki, and, and she's been through this before, so for you as a, a first-time student athlete now, is it tough? combining classes and practice and games and travel and all that and getting your work done? Um, I'm pretty sure travel is about the worst of it, like just trying to keep up with everything, but I'm pretty good with that, so it's all right. Has your playing time been about what you expected or have you played more than you thought you were going to in your freshman year? Um, I came in here and I just wanted to be 
a team player, I would do anything that the team would require me to. So, I mean, I am thankful for the opportunity that the coaches have given me, and I hope to make an impact on the team in the future years to come. Would you give yourself a passing grade so far this year? <laughs> it's hard to judge myself on that, but um, I think I've done well, but I mean, there's still more improvements to come. Thanks. Good luck this weekend. Thank you. Jacksonville State will host Murray State Friday night, 7 o'clock. Austin P. Saturday at 7, and that's again after the homecoming football game. And remember, free admission for all Jacksonville State volleyball here at Pete Matthews Coliseum.